it's not just only me. It's <laughs> this is a global. Right, right. And actually, let me tell you something. I used to have a cat, and yesterday she used to say meow. Today she is saying Allah. Even my cat. But this is not my topic, sir. I'm asking you why you converted to Islam. I am an Arab man. I am a scholar in Islam. And I'm asking you a question. Why you converted to Islam? I'm not going to tell you how many people live in Islam a day, because this is my nation I know better than you. According to Al Jazeera TV, 16,000 Muslims live in Islam a day. But this is not the topic. The topic is, sir, why you said you accepted Islam? What is the reason? And we will talk about it. 16,000 Muslims live in Islam a day from Al Jazeera TV. But this is not the topic. Don't change my topic, please. Why you? What is the best thing for about Islam for you? Make you convert to Islam? We will talk about it. Your mind. Hey, well, please let me talk to people and ask you a question. Don't just pull me away. Let me talk to you and explain that the reason I convert to Islam is because it's the truth and it's the reality. That's the only religion in the sight of God. That's what converted me to Islam. Okay, let us talk about reality then. Guys, he, he mentioned a reason. Makes sense. Reality. Okay. Is it reality that, you know, your prophet Muhammad, he said to you, when you go to the heaven of Allah, you will have 72 women and 300 boys? Is that a dream or reality? Your mic. It don't matter about material flesh. Sit down, sit down. Go drink Pepsi yourself. Mr. MG, is it reality that you will get 72 horny women, special made by Allah for sex as sex slave, and the 300 boys, your mic? Man, brother, you just a big one of the big hypocrites and puppets that, that opened this room. You are nothing but full of shit. Don't add something. So, you see, I did not say shit, but you just mentioned it. By the way, you can say the name of Allah because Allah have many names, but you do not need to use that name exactly, please. I have no problem. Did I make you hot? Well, this is I am, Christian prince who make Muslims get hot and I burn them. Answer me. Is it true that the Quran says you will have 72 horny women and 300 boys? Yes or no? If yes, explain. If no, explain. Your mic. Don't use bad words, please. Yeah, but let me explain. Give me a chance. Let me talk to people there. If I say something right, you just put me away. Let me explain. Give me a chance, please. There's nothing about boys in, in Islam there. I mean, the Prophet Muhammad is... Okay, if we show you the proof, what you will do? Ice-T, can you post for him the verse It says boys? Can you post it? If we show it to you, it means you are a liar. If we could not show it, it means we are a liar. Is that fair, guys? Is that fair? What do you think? He said nothing in Islam talking about boys. He just said that. Everybody heard you. So if we show you the verse and we make you read by your own eyes, what you will do? Your mic. Brother, you, uh, man, you nothing but a fag. For real. You are a fag and big fag and forever fag. You are a big liar and hypocrite. Talk to me as a man and debate with me if you can. But don't just pull me away. Please let me debate with you then. Don't act like a fact because I see you representing facts. You don't represent the Christian in this room. Man. You are not representing Christian. You represent the facts. Regardless, I am representing who? It's your duty to answer. Why you are worried about my license plate but not answering me? I want an answer. I give you the mic, you cry like a puppy in the, in the mic. You are a fag, you are a fag. Yeah, I am the, from the fag club. None of your business. I want an answer, sir. Why your God? You said in the Quran there is nothing about boys. I, challenge me. I can give you the verse in a second. And we will see who is a liar, either you or me. Do you challenge your mic? Hey, 
said, man, I'm not going to listen to you, man. You're nothing but a crap. Because you're not debating me now here. Let me talk at least five minutes and explain to people what the Islam is all about. It's the only way there. Whether you like, you're talking about 16,000 people convert to Christianity every day in Islam. We are not talking about Volkswagen now. Not yet. We are talking about boys in Quran. Don't change the topic. Coward. If we show you that the Quran says we'll give you a lot of boys. How an African, he accepts slaves in the heaven. Aren't you against slavery? Is it okay in Islam, even in heaven, to have slaves, to enslave other people, to use them and abuse them? Your mic. Man, the religion of Islam, I tell you what, it's for everybody, not only for white and black. I'm a black man, let me tell you that. And I love Islam more than my own life then. Yeah, because you want to practice what's been done for you. You want to slave others. Otherwise, tell me how you accept 300 boys to be your slaves. Your mic? I tell you what. You can tell everybody what you want. But I tell you what. Islam is the, <laughs> is the future made for everybody. Whether you like it or not. That's the truth. Let me tell you this. Let me show you this. Islam is Las Vegas for everybody, yes. Women in there are naked, people are wicked. Let me tell you this, let me tell you this. My wife will be naked, dancing for me. And boys are naked all over me. Let me tell you this, this. Let me tell you this, yes. Let me tell you this. Islam, not for me. You, Mike. I swear to God, by the grace of Allah, Islam is the future. The world is going to be full of Islam, man. The world is... Listen, the world is full of Islam. According to study, last time in Discovery Channel, I said... There is no way to fight cockroaches. They are in every house. What? I don't know. What do you mean? Answer the question. Come on, man. Why the Quran says you will have boys in the heaven? And they will not bleed. Tell me, they are servant? They are for sex? What they will do for you exactly? Your mic. You know what? I don't know your name, but you not you call yourself a Christian prince, a Christian prince. You don't even make a sense, man. I just came here to debate with you, but you, you seems like a fag that who want to get dick. That's what you seem like. I don't have time for you, man. If you don't have time for me, I'm not asking you to have time for me. I'm asking you to answer me simply. For God's sake, answer the question. Okay, don't answer me. Answer the room. Hey, room. Do you want to know why Allah will give him 300 boys for sex in heaven? Just question. Answer the question for the room, not for me. Forget about me. Forget about me, please. Your mic. Potato, tomato. I am the one who make you salad, all you Muslims. You run, are you coward? Potato Nation. Potato Nation, I'm here for you. I will do cook, cook you. You will be cooked by me. Shame on Muhammad, shame on you. Potato, potato, where are you? All you run from me, you. Uh, Venom Vang X, your mic, quiet. 